Is your PlayStation 5 freezing while you're in the middle of a game? Today, we're going to be talking about how to fix your PlayStation 5 when it's freezing. Let's get right into this. First, if your PlayStation 5 did freeze, you're going to want to completely shut it down. To do this, Hold the power button on your console until you hear two beeps. This will completely shut down your PlayStation 5. The next thing you're going to want to do is clean your PlayStation 5. Unplug the power and HDMI cables from your PS5. Take off both covers from your PlayStation 5. It's really easy to do and it does not affect warranty because you're not opening up your console. With the white covers off, you can see the fan. Now over time, dirt and dust can accumulate on your PlayStation 5 causing it to overheat and freeze. Use a microfiber cloth to clean and remove any dust around the vents and inside the covers that you did remove. Also, you're gonna to want to inspect the fan. If you see any dirt or dust inside, use a soft brush to remove it. Now, by only removing the covers, you can clean out most of the dust that does accumulate for your PlayStation 5. However, if you want to go more in depth, you can open up your PlayStation 5. Keep in mind that will alter the warranty for you, but you can do that as well. And also, if you find that there is a bigger issue with your PlayStation 5, you can also replace the thermal paste. Most people with the freezing issue is because there is a lot of dirt and dust in their PlayStation 5. So hopefully if by just cleaning it out, that will fix the issue for you. Next, if that didn't work, you will want to adjust your settings on your PlayStation 5. One common cause for the PlayStation 5 freezing is having too many application opens or too many games running in the background, which is something that I experienced personally. I didn't realize with the PlayStation 5, if you do switch games, the other games still run in the background until you close them completely. So make sure that you close everything when you're done with it before you launch the next game. The next thing you're gonna want to check is to make sure that your PlayStation 5 is updated. Sony will periodically release new updates to fix bugs and improve performance. To make sure that you have the latest updates, you're going to want to go into settings and select system software updates. From there, you can tell to see if there is an update that is ready to go. Most of the time you can set it to automatically update next time you turn your PlayStation 5 on, but sometimes there is ones that just get stuck there and you don't know there is an update available. And this could cause other issues with your PlayStation 5 or other features of the PlayStation 5 not to work properly. Now, hopefully one of these fixes did work for you, adjusting your settings, closing applications that you're not using, making sure your PlayStation 5 is updated, thoroughly cleaning out your PlayStation 5, making sure there's no dirt or dust inside, and if you have to, replacing the thermal paste. For most people, one of those fixes will fix the issue with the freezing of the PlayStation 5 and even overheating issues, but if it didn't, there might be a hardware issue with your PlayStation 5. Hopefully your PlayStation 5 is under warranty. If it is, or even if it isn't, then you can contact Sony directly to get the next steps rolling. But for most people, one of these fixes usually work for you. Hope you guys enjoyed this video and hopefully you can get back to gaming with your PlayStation 5 no longer freezing. I'll see you guys in the next video. Please take care. Peace.